everybody, it's Lily. I'm in the desert outside Quartzsite and that is, we are in the middle of a super bloom. You see all those beautiful yellow flowers? They're everywhere. I'm not sure what they're like, called. I'll give you a close up picture. They're pretty. They kind of remind me of buttercups or something, but they're big bushy things. As you can see, and they are all over out here. It's just a sea of yellow everywhere you look. Not only that, but there's other flowers. There's these little purple things everywhere you look. These beautiful purple flowers. And there's some more of the yellow. See, we're out here in Quartzsite at the Long-Term Visitor Center. It's just beautiful. Yellow flowers everywhere, everywhere you look. I haven't seen any cactuses in bloom, but we got lots of wildflowers here, everywhere. And there's these pink things. I don't know what they're called either, but... I don't know, Dan was calling them some kind of fairy thing. Fairy brush. As you can see. They are very beautiful. Those are all over. See, there we are. In the desert. By Quartzsite. Oh, we got this bird that just will not shut up, I tell you. Even in the middle of the night, I can hear him. Somebody said it was a mockingbird, so I guess I'll take their word for it. But, oh, look at these views. Just yellow everywhere. Beautiful yellow. I guess we're in the middle of a super bloom, is what I've been told by other people. But look at these flowers. Love it. Have to be careful because I was told the snakes are out too. Different people have seen a few snakes. So if I keep looking down, that's why. And there you can see this. Pretty, pretty flowers. They got little white things on them. I don't know what those are. Those purple flowers. Oh, yes, and there's our birdie. Our camp birdie. Driving us nuts at night. Because he literally, he's in the middle of the night, he's doing that too. He just never shuts up. I don't know if he's trying to attract a mate or what, but. There, let's see. There we are. See those pretty pink bushes? Lots of green too. It's amazing the amount of green we have. So, that's where I'm at, still in Quartzsite, for a couple of days, and then we're heading east. Ooh, there are those yellow-orange flowers, but they kind of look like poppy. Got to be careful, though. Like I said, there are snakes out. Those beautiful yellow-orange ones. They look kind of like a poppy. They're very delicate. Yeah, you can see them here and there, too. Dan picked me some the other day. So, yeah. There it is. I will. Aren't those beautiful? I'm in the shade now. And I'm watching very carefully to make sure I don't encounter a snake. So my camera's wobbly. I'm sorry, but yeah, I don't want to get bit by a snake. Especially if we don't have insurance. Very costly. This is another bush that's very interesting here. It's got these little bulbs on it, you can see. And then little yellow flowers. That's different than these things. Oh, and of course there are butterflies out here too. Butterflies, moths. Spring has come to the desert. That's for sure. It's 
spring has come. It's March 20 something, 26, 27. There's a moth flying around. Yeah, they're everywhere. I'm sure there's scorpions and shit too, but I'll try to stay away from them. So look at them, all those pink flowers. They're fading a little though. These pink flowers are fading. And then there's the white ones. So yeah, it's just beautiful out here. It's not drab and brown anymore. It's very, very green. And there are flowers everywhere I look. There are big clumps of these yellow flowers. Super bloom, yay. There's our camp way over. Right there. And there's some more views of the desert. Mountains, cacti. Moths and butterflies. Can't see him. You can sure hear him, but you can't see him. Little friend there. Our camp bird. Oop, oh, he's flying up. Building a nest, maybe. Yep, so there are trees out here, and some of the trees have some green bushy leaves, lots of plants. Lots of plants in this super bloom. There are some more. Pretty yellow ones. They remind me of daisies, but they're not quite like daisies. They're more like their petals are shaped more like asters, I guess. There we go. There's another one of those bushes. There, you see? There we are. Go through here. Yeah, those pink ones are fading. They were pretty bright when we first arrived here about 10 days ago. There's some more pretty yellow flowers underneath the tree. And even more. Even more. So, what do you think, guys? Desert isn't always blah. Sometimes it's just gorgeous. It's getting hot out. Today it's supposed to be 86, I guess. So I will just sit in front of a fan and read a book. Try to write a little bit. I've been very successful in writing. Distracted. Too distracted. But this is our backyard right now. See all the moths? All the moths flying around, getting excited. And there's a view from the other side. So, here's Lily saying peace out. You guys have a Zen day. There is our coachman, Leprechaun, right there with the blue canopy. Have a great, have a very Zen day. Click subscribe if you want to follow me on my journeys. This isn't a channel that makes money. It's just me logging, vlogging about my adventures with my family. First time view of the desert, desert life. And kind of a new to RVing. Seven, eight months in. Anyway, peace out. Subscribe if you like and I'll have more adventures for you. And have a very zen day. Thanks for watching.